This Obamacare volunteer explains that your insurance costs go up 50 percent or more. So but there are some things that they can still uh, raise your premiums for. And so uh, two of them I want to talk about for a second. Um, one of them is smoker status. So, uh, and that's a pretty hefty fee that you're going to have to pay if you're a smoker. The insurance company is allowed to charge you 50 percent more on your premium than the general cost of that premium. Wow. So, if they are charging a premium out there of 142 dollars a month, and you come in and you're a smoker, they can charge you 70 dollars more on that premium. So, if you are a smoker, now's the time to quit before you go onto the website and answer all the questions and fill out the application. So. Um, I'm a smoker myself, so I, I, I feel this pinch as well. Not only the taxes I pay for my cigarettes, but also my health insurance is now relaxed. Yep. But that didn't stop the federally funded Obamacare navigators from counseling us the importance of defrauding the government by lying about your smoker status to lower your premiums. More question. Mm -hmm. <laughs> they have, I, I don't know where it said, it said something about if you smoke or something like that. The, I don't really don't smoke. I may... Lie because your premiums are getting high. Okay, okay. Don't tell them that. Don't tell them that. about that. One navigator even told us that she lies all the time. But don't tell them that. Uh, I always tell lie on mine. Okay. <laughs> and while Enroll America reminds us that your private health care data is safe... They cannot sell or do anything with your... They have They have agreed that, I mean, and, and they will be... Uh, uh, they will be charged to the fullest extent of the law if they if they are found to 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 uh, do anything with your with your information. I mean, they're gonna do they're gonna do some time and there's gonna be some heavy fines done to to ensure that uh, you know all the security that you all the all the information that you give them is is secure. We're working in Austin, San Antonio, Houston, Dallas, Fort Worth area. We're out in El Paso, and we're in the we're in the valley. Well, you'll just have to stay tuned for the next video. There's a new sheriff in town.